I'm Jenny with Gunter Creative. I wanted to show you my new books. This will be a four part video series where I show you how I've combined several new skills and processes um, with my old skill and love of bookmaking. I've been making books for about 25 years, so to me that's the easy part. But I am new to leather and uh, lasering leather. I'm going to share with you everything I've learned and hopefully you'll have feedback for me and maybe even buy a file or a finished book. Um, links to my files and all the supplies that I've purchased are in the description. I think if I'm on YouTube I kind of have to say please like my videos and subscribe to my channel and then you'll be alerted to all the new videos that I upload. So on this little adventure, I started out wanting to make leather long stitch style books. Um, I didn't like the pinky color, the natural vegetable tan leather. Um, so I tried to dye it and first time I did it, it looks horrible. It's all streaky. I just put the, the dye on the leather without any preparation or research and it didn't work. Um, and I thought some leather dye markers would be great. No, not really. Uh, did these geometric designs and tried to make solid colors with markers, but it really just looks like markers. Uh, so here's, here's another one that I tried. I wasn't happy with it at all. So then I found some leather acrylic paint and those did better. Here's an example of the leather acrylic paint, but I still wasn't getting the solid colors that I needed with this type of design. Um, so, what I did was decided to change the type of design that I used. Or, so here's one of the first ones I did. I did drawings um, of my azaleas and this is the acrylic leather paint. So the um, flower drawings lended themselves a lot better to this type of media because you don't have to get solid colors. What I ended up with was a design that has the elastic in the back and it holds the book together. These books are really nice for travel books, notebooks, and so far I've just been putting blank paper on the inside. Here's another design, different flowers. Need another design. I also have used the designs in earrings. You can do the same process. Earrings. Um, I plan to design covers for all the state flowers. I use Illustrator on the iPad with the Apple Pencil. So they're all vector drawings and all you have to do is score them and cut out the outside of the book. So the files will have the drawing and all the holes in the outside. So you'll let the laser do all that type work. Um, then you don't really have to paint it. If you don't want to, it looks kind of cool just like that. So for this one, these are poppy flowers, and that would be the front cover. Then af after you've got your cover complete, the bookmaking is actually the easy part. This type of style of book is just stitched up and down, the little bit of a link stitch at the end of every signature. Um, I'll show you how to do all these things in the next few videos. Uh, please join me in making books. Uh, take a look at parts two through four and don't hesitate to comment if you have any questions. 
You can also reach me at our website, guntercreative.com or through Etsy, and you'll find the links in the description to all these things. Thank you and happy bookmaking.